Alright, hang on. Oh, dragon sent from up above. Oh, you know, you make my world light up. When I was down, you brought me up. Like that fairy up there. Oh, I, oh, I, oh, I. Think Spyro is high, oh high, oh high. So we, oh we, oh we, are gonna go to the high, oh high, high caves. <laughs> that worked yeah. out perfectly. Yeah, I had to have the song in the background, but that's the intro for today. Alright, let's go! Yeah! If you're if you're want to be clever, you can add the actual music over that. Although it might be a little tricky. I think it will be considering this game has actual music playing all the time. Yeah, I can re-record it again later if you want to try. I think we're I think it'll be, sound pretty good without it. It sounded pretty yeah. good to me. That's good. Yeah. As, as, when as soon as I saw the name of the stage, I, I wanted to do that. Okay, he's going unnecessarily. High again, and I'm pretty sure the last time he did that was a flying. No, it was not a flying stage. Good. <laughs> I got worried. Riders! I can't kill it either. No, you can't. <coughs> you just have to hit it and then hit it on the back. Well, that a twister. He's a yeah. twister guy. Twister wizard. Alrighty. They're probably good, Twister. Ah, you got me, I got you. Alrighty. So how is this? This is... Okay, you're dead. That was fast. Yep. One of these days will be a level without dying again. Uh-oh, and you're on your last life, too. Yeah, so... The day we learn what happens when you get a game over. Maybe. It's either gonna be very good uh, or like really not too bad or very very bad. Watch out for tornadoes. Cyrus. Huh. Please do something about these green druids. They insist on moving everything in sight. Like your hat? I don't know. <sighs> so there's a guy over there that I totally missed and I don't think yep last chance to live I can't well see I anything. lost well you're getting your wish are you game over? Yeah. Reigniting. Hmm. Look at him, he looks so sad. How long does it take to reignite? Apparently not long at all. Right, good, you were blessed. It just wait, is this the first world again? No, this is the magic realm. Okay, good. <coughs> Oh, he got away. He very much got away. On the bright side, I don't have to recollect everything. Yep. And they gave you a pity life. I have four. I said five. Oh, well, cool. How about we go somewhere else, like Alpine Ridge? No, go back to where you were. We gotta do it eventually. Well, I mean, yeah, but... I don't know where it was. We'll find it. Give you a chance to learn navigational skills. Mm -hmm. Found it. Yep, was that so hard? Time to get high again. Don't actually get high, kids. That's a very, very bad idea. Unless... Actually, no. 
we can't talk about getting high because kids aren't allowed to watch this video. Yeah. My videos are my videos are not allowed for kids. You used to want to try and cater to families, and then you went, eh, I'm an adult, let's be an adult. I mean, I didn't want YouTube taking down everything for the least minor thing. Um, playing this game actually kind of counts as the least minor thing. Yeah, so if I want to play this game, I can't be on family-friendly thing. No, uh, hang on, let me explain this. Uh... Yeah, you're, um... If YouTube catches you playing a game that is supposed to be designated for a family audience like this game, and you market it as only for adults, you can still get in trouble. Because you did not market your video correctly. And there's this big, like, a thousand dollar fine or something. There can't be- they can't possibly be that. I could go check the rules of COPPA if you want. Well, I'm still marking this as as uh, not family friendly because I'm not being family friendly when I'm talking in this video. Every word you say is evil. Ajax. I hate those bugs. When I become big and strong like you, I'll squash them all. Until then, remember that supercharge <laughs> makes you invincible. What? Nothing. I'm just reading policies. Uh huh. I might need to do it this way. I hate the new YouTube. It's hard to navigate. Well, I know who you can thank for the for the COPPA rules. Uh, does his name begin with a P and rhyme with you? No, it's not Peter Molyneux. No, that's not who I was talking about. I'm ta uh, it's it's actually debated that it's because of a a YouTube a YouTube kid known as Ryan who. Uh, well, they, they changed the rules specifically for him. Really? That sounds like a big fat rumor. So, uh, that's the best. Close thing I've heard. Cedric! Try combining your supercharge with jumping and gliding, and really explore the high caves. All dragons found. We can leave. That was fast. Yeah, it's not a very big level. Zoe giggled when we hit her head. <laughs> You're free to look up whether or not it was Ryan's fault, but until you find otherwise, I'm blaming him. It was YouTube's fault, actually. I know, but uh... was he the catalyst? No, it was YouTube's fault because they were illegally gathering advertisement data on kids' usage of the internet. And that's illegal because you can't do that. So they had to, the FCC had to bring down the law on everyone. I'm sorry, the FTC. And now we all have to suffer for it. Yeah. You know what they sound like, Anthony? They sound like big blowhards. See? Jokes. Uh -huh. Jokes. Okay, sure, whatever. If you fail to categorize your content correctly, there may be consequences on you too. Yeah, well, I'm not and being family. Yeah, 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 yeah. Additionally, there may be legal 
consequences under COPPA or other applicable local laws. Well, considering I said Frick's sake in the last episode and in this one now, I don't think it can be categorized as family friendly. The game's family friendly. Yeah, well, I've played other games that are considered family friendly and I haven't heard anything about that. Thankfully, we're small enough that they probably won't find us. But as you grow, they will get you. Most likely. I'm still reading the rules. Hang on. General, there's a lot of legal stuff I need to deal with here. Oh, this is a boss battle, by the way. Oh, cool. Uh, I should be paying attention, but... Uh... You want information on Kappa, and I'm getting that. Hello, dragon. Altair. Thanks for releasing me, Spyro. You have no idea how long I've been trapped in Crystal. And, uh, neither do I. Who are you again? <laughs> um, I'm out of here. Don't panic. Don't panic? I'm reading random words. <laughs> Yeah, I did a whole thing on Kappa and I forgot a bunch of the stuff I learned from it. That's how memory works. And as I've said before and I'll say it again, memory is a fickle bitch, though mine is more like a sleeping bitch. Uh, if we need confirmation, this video is not for kids. Which reminds me, I had to edit a lot of stuff you said on my channel because I do kind of market towards a more general audience than you do and I don't like something like that being said. Yeah. So you can't blame me. You can't say I'm wrong. For what? Memory is a fickle bitch, and mine is more like a sleeping bitch. It is very much so. In fact, I bet you can't tell me what happened on Tuesday. When was Tuesday again? Tuesday was a few days ago. Oh, well then no. <laughs> so I'm not wrong. Or are you just not trying to remember? Anthony, I had two head I had two closed head injuries when I was a kid and the the uh and the subsequent uh 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 okay, so like one of one of the long term problems of having concussions is memory problems later in life. And I'm having those, so and I had two concussions when I was a kid, so... Yeah. It's time for you to buy Prevagen. Healthier brain, better life. Yeah, well, I can't help... I don't know if it'll be able to fix my brain. It's, it's, it's for the brain. It helps with memory. Good. Maybe I'll get diagnosed for something like that. I just see the ad for it all the time. So, I don't need it. Why are we stopping? To check and see. Okay, we don't have. A... You're Are just you... missing eggs, I think. Yeah, and I don't care as much about those since we're not playing the third game right now. It's gonna be a few years probably before we get to game number three. Hey, by the way, what's the percentage for completion now? I don't know. Go into guidebook land. Uh. Game total 36. 36%, alright, not too bad. We have time for one more place, so let's go to Alpine Ridge. Alpine Ridge, it's easy as Fall Pine Ridge. Alpine Ridge, Fall Pine Ridge, Alpine Ridge. <sighs> what are you not fan of trilogy? No, I had to, I had a, I had a, I had a shiver. It's a little uh, bit cold in I'm here. I'm just doing all the medicine endorsements today. I don't actually endorse them, it's just I know about them. <sighs> I'm actually happy to admit that I'm not on any medication. I'm on several. Several? I thought you were only on one. 
Oh, I also have two kinds of allergy medication. Oh, I'm talking more about medications for stuff that's not allergies. Oh, well, okay then. Allergy medicine's kind of a necessity. Especially when you live in Texas and you're allergic to cedar trees. <laughs> hey, Merry Christmas, I got you something. Ah, oh, it's a cedar tree. <laughs> the day Rhonda plants cedar trees is the day I sue her for, uh, for, uh, being, trying to, trying to hurt, kill me. You'd have to prove, you, well, you actually probably could be able to easily prove it. I can prove that I'm allergic to cedar trees. No, yet you'd have to prove that she explicitly planted them with the intent of killing you. I can That's still call. I can still call the police on her like she calls the police on us whenever our grass is too tall. All right, what are you gonna call her on? She's trying to kill me. She planted cedar trees, and I'm highly allergic. We don't care. Goodbye. That's what the police are gonna say. And yet they came out when we moved our car to the front uh, area of our lawn. They probably bored. Zane. Spyro, you're not afraid of those big, noisy, gigantic, awful beasts, are you? Of course not! Oh, good. I didn't think so. Alrighty. 43. Wow, we're over halfway there. Yep. How about that? I was about to say I'm good at this game, and then I died. Alrighty. Yum. Up. Oh, sorry, we're closed. Come back in a couple seconds. Hey, I'm open again. Prepare to die. Well, I want to die. Oh no, it's too late. Uh, gliding time. Hello. Goodbye. I'll be like swimming. I don't know how family friendly this game is anyway, because we killed a lot of people. I mean, if, if it's rated E, it's family friendly. Sure. You don't sound convinced. Hey, Eldred! Thank you for releasing me. I actually have an Uncle Eldred in real life. Okay. It's rated E10 for ages 10 and up. Okay then. <sighs> and the game froze. N only on your side. I know. Let me know when it comes back. It'll be back one day. Well, let me know if okay. I need to... Do I need to reset the capture? No, we're good. It fixed? Yeah. Even if it did fix, I wouldn't tell you. Why wouldn't you tell me? Because we have to then waste time trying to troubleshoot when we'd be able to progress normally just by me guessing what's going on. Well, I mean, Joe always tells me if his capture stops. Oh. I'm a little more laid back. I've noticed. Yeah. You also don't say goodbye at the end of the videos like Joe does. Yeah, I don't say bye. Why, is that bother you or something? Yeah, it's fine. Xander! Great work, Spyro! If you keep this up, You'll learn all the tricks of the Magic Crafter's world. Aha! That's not all of them, though. That's not why I was saying haha. -ha. Why were you saying haha -ha, then? That's for me to know and you to never find out. You know I hate it when you do that. Oh, really? Okay. I like knowing stuff. Alright. 
Pythagorean theorem is a squared plus b squared equals c squared. Thank you, Professor Snape. Uh, I got another life. Theory of, theory of relativity means something relative. Uh, Physics is some abstract content or concept that is now as useless in the modern world as astrology. At least that's what most people say. Well, considering he never unified gravity with the other parts of his theorem, it doesn't make sense anyway. The theorem of relativity? That's, far, that's some, it's something Sheldon said. Ah. I don't I rightly know anything about... I don't know that much about physics. It was one of my worst subjects. Uh, I'm grateful I don't have to take physics anymore. I'm grateful I don't have to take math anymore. I've not had to take math for three years, and it's been great. And you're gonna make it. Alrighty then. Look at my pillar of stone tableness. I've got sparks oh. back. I didn't even notice he was gone. Now you will, because he's gone again. Yeah. Uh, hopefully there's a checkpoint soon. Yay, 396. Actually, actually, that was uh, really close to what he sounded like. <laughs> no, I wasn't even trying. Uh, you better be quick. Fire! <coughs> I guess falling induces coughing. And we're back here. Great. Easy to get back there. Wee, you might not make it. Oh, you made it. I was unsure at first. Yay, health you didn't need. Reflex reaction. Yeah. If you had reflex reacted, you could have refilled on health right now. And there you go. The wizards of this cliff. Giant keyhole window. I mean, it's a magic world, so yeah. Yeah. Uh, what? Do you go to that middle thing that's kind of in the middle of nowhere? Hey, Zippoos! Alright, let's try it. Wee! Sheep. Perfect. All There's right. the last dragon. All right, now how do you get there? Yeah, you don't know. You're gonna need to find it out. There's got to be an entrance somewhere. Try the back door. Huh? There actually is something over here, but it's not nothing. It's the key window again. Wait, what the? Turn around! Turn around! Turn around! I saw a little cliff you could climb on. Now it's just weird rockness. Yeah, weird rock textures. The weird rock looked like you could actually climb oh. into a hole above it. Hang on. You can try and climb up high and glide in? Yeah. Alright, let's see how well this will fail. So Maybe it'll be funny. So I'm probably not having much optimism, but... Well, actually we might. And we are gonna. Nicely done, my friend. Kelvin. Also, thank you. Kelvin! Now that these blue thieves have stolen eggs outside the Magic Crafters world as well. Don't worry. I'll take care of them. Alrighty. Ah, oh, speaking of which... Get the man! Get the man! He's going far. Indeed. Uh, any day now. Any day now. This is my least favorite part of the game, I think. Get used to it. We're going to see a lot more of these guys in the third game. I might not do the third game if that's the you case. You promised you would. I can break promises. 
You tell me you never break promises. Ah, uh, uh, that might be a promise we're breaking too. Haha. <laughs> yeah, this is getting old. I yeah, got him. Definitely your opportunity to get him. I took care of him. All right, and now we can leave the stage. Yep, because all the rest is just gems. Definitely. And we haven't been gated yet. All right, once we get out of here, a little more jumping to do. Jumpity, jumpity, jump. Away from this world. 3480. So what, we're at the third world and we have and we're halfway there. That's good. Gem wise. Yeah. So thank y'all for watching this episode of Spyro the Reignited Trilogy. If you liked it, leave me a like. If you're new around here, subscribe, go check out Anthony's channel. We'll see y'all next time. Bless you. Oh yeah, Rick. I'm JFK from Clone High, and I am telling you to subscribe to the Geeky Skunk Gamer and his friends, GeoJo2000 and uh, uh, LuigiFan891!